After Edward Warlock, come here for a minute. Where are you? We what have a sheriff's office in the tumbleweed in the train that goes goes to Armadillo. Those two are dangerous takes. Mm -hmm. I think we should rob them both. Both? Like last time? Hmm. Yeah. I mean, how do you expect this to do that? Well, I'm assuming it'll be, well, exactly like last time. Two teams split up, and well, just... I would say hopefully the law just stays on one again, but there's no way that's gonna happen. No, the train has its own security, so that wouldn't work anyway. Nope. Yeah, here's the thing, though. <clears throat> Either one of those jobs... We're gonna have to get the hell out of here. Agreed. That's true. That's true. We'll have the real world after us. Yeah. Honestly, staying here right now, just... I hate it. Uh, if that's enough for us to get out of here, then by all means, let's get the hell out of here. Alright, let's we'll see. And if it's not... Oh, shit, uh... Well, either one is a dangerous job. I don't think two people are gonna cut it alone, but we got no choice. One of these teams is gonna have to I mean, deal two with just two can people. Cut the, two people can cut the tumbleweed job easily, just add a wee bit of extra firepower while the train job... Yeah, that can be done, except the train's gonna keep moving. So hmm. God knows where they'll end up. I guess let's... Uh, I guess... I could talk with Clyde. Maybe... Maybe we could just stop the train. But even then, that also has its own consequences, since if we do that, we're sitting ducks. Well, I mean, if we wait till the train gets far enough out of town, we could stop it. And then if shit comes, we started ourselves. I mean, that's... Uh, Who'd have put on each child? And make a plan, and we, we really have no choice but to just go for it. We can't sit well, here. Well, I say for now, let's just sleep. Sleep on. Yeah, we'll tell Clyde I'll see about you, it. gentlemen, later. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Arthur, <clears throat> if we're gonna get out of here, uh, remember I told you about that wall. We could always see if there's some land out there we could set up camp. Should we do that before or after? I'd say after. Alright, I'll remember that. Yeah. See you. Do you ever sleep or something? You weren't there at the debriefing. <sighs> no, I was <clears throat> clearing my head. Okay. Kinda needed you there. I'll just uh briefly explain the plan. Uh so it's it's pretty simple. Uh Arthur kinda said something just it's gonna more or less be like last time. We kinda have no choice but to split into two teams. Since well, Claire wants to rob both of them, uh, that's a lot more risky, but if that's how we're doing it, then we need to split into two. Is anything less would be, um, <laughs> we'll die. So I was thinking, uh, shit. I say, you, Arthur, Claire, you go after it. Okay. Hop on the train, but you wait. Wait until the train gets to a certain spot, secluded, no one's around, you don't see any patrols, nothing like that. Then you take the driver out and stop it. Grab everything and hop off quick and easy as long as nothing goes wrong, but, you know, expect everything. Well, right. the sheriff's office, you don't really need to worry about that, but I was thinking just, well, Farlock and Joel just go together again. It would be kinda, well, be a bad idea to send them both in there since they just robbed the place, but it means little since we're leaving. I'm gonna stay here and help Crips pack up the camp, and we're gonna head out. Good. If we don't Still come back a in a day to... or two, get the hell out of here. Yeah, we need a place to actually go to. Uh, 
Arthur said you mentioned something about going over a wall to see if there's any land? Yeah, we'll take care of that. Okay, okay, yeah, if you could find us a spot, that'd be swell. Well, uh, yeah, that's, that's just about it. Good. Thank you, Clyde. No problem. Yeah. Actually, it reminded me of Keith a little bit. Shit, shit. Let's go. Fuck. Help! Shit! Help! Oh. Come Let's on, go. you fool! Just book it. Get on my horse. Let's go. This is a shit show again. Fuck shit. Uh, Joel, before we go on, yeah. right, man? I need to speak to you a second, right? Alright. So answer me this then. What was that then? What do you mean? It was a shit show. Yeah, I didn't expect that many. You walked in, today. shot the sheriff in the head, then you almost got yourself fucking killed. I mean, we're fine. I, we made it happen. I mean, what have you got shot? What have I you got stuck? What if I just left? What if I didn't come back? What if I didn't come back to help? What would have happened? What would I say to the rest of them? I lost them. I don't know. Look, it's not about that, Joel. Look, man. You're my best friend, but, right? Don't put me in that position again. If I was to lose you, I don't know what I'd do. These fools here ain't any better. Probably get more of a drunk, but, yeah, now I hear you. Let's just go in. Hand the money. I'll not mention what happened. Just say that it went smoothly, right? At least we got five grand. <laughs> uh, you wish. Yeah. Alright. Let's get up next to it and jump on. few guards. Oh, I see one. We're gonna have to take this silently. I think we could take him loud. Conductor would hear us. Hmm. Maybe they'll move. Just wait a little bit. We're not exactly at our destination yet. Come on. Oh, they're pulling into a station. Oh, one of them's moving. All right, Arthur, you get the one up there. Search this one. Who the, the one fuck are back. you? What the fuck you doing, my? Sorry, what the buddy. fuck? Ah. No. Ah. God. There's ah. a lot of crates here. Come on, there's gotta be something. Box. Okay. Not bad. Hey Edward, I found I found some gold. Gold. Gold bars. Gold bars in these crates. It's only it's only a couple, but 
That works. Not to be in love. Yeah, I think that'll work. Okay. Uh, Arthur. What'd you think? Here we go. You didn't search over here. I got some. Come on. All right. You just put your hands up right now. Oh, shit. Oh, you got him. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I got him. <clears throat> Too bad. That was actually pretty easy. Yeah. Pretty decent yeah. take, too. Shit. I saw someone. Ah, <sighs> shit. Come on, come on, come on. Get on. Okay. Come on, woman. Let's go. So, where'd you find Arthur? Well, I found some bonds and a lot of cash. That'll work. We just got to figure out how to cash them. You're not exactly sure how. We never really robbed Will Bonds before. I just know of their existence. Yeah, uh, we'll figure it out. Let's turn off left here. All right, right behind you. Claire here found two gold bars. Okay, yeah. pretty good take. Let's just hope Will, Joel, and the Irishman can get just enough so we can actually get the hell out of here. Yeah. I don't know. This may just be enough for us to get out. But after that, I'm not sure. Uh, stop up here. You said you saw someone before we left? Yep, reinforcements. Shit. Right, get on out of here, boy. We'll hold down in this shack for a bit. Yeah. And we'll leave at sunset. There. This shack was looks so burnt up. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep an eye out. Definitely Make old. Sure nothing sneaks up on us. Good idea. It's nice to have coal on. Uh, went. Uh, I don't well, know what to say about it anymore. Uh, we huh? done now, right? Uh, what's Where did you up? Go? Uh, Almost it died. Was, it went well. We got money. All right, yeah. went pretty Good. smoothly on our end too. So, <laughs> yeah, that's great actually. Got a bunch of money. I think it's time we but, get uh, out of here. On a completely unrelated note, I agree. I see that the camp is pretty much packed up. Yeah. Yeah. Well, All I think a good help. do is get out of here, and then we could celebrate. Yeah, you Celebration, guys. I think me and him have already done that. <laughs> you could tell. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah. Arthur. Yep. We gotta go check out that land. See if there's anything worth our time up there. Sure. Let me just actually get a drink myself for the road. Yeah, you guys get the horses ready for the wagons, I guess. Uh, yeah. Alright. Almost there. So, if there is some good land up here, what do you think it's going to be like? Uh, I really hope it's just not any more desert. <laughs> yeah. I guess I just got used to seeing it all. Didn't realize how bland it actually is. Honestly, this place sucks. <laughs> it's always hot. Yeah. But the second the sun falls, it's freezing. Yeah. But, we'll see. I mean, I doubt the temperature's gonna change too much. Actually, see some grass. That's a good sign. <clears throat> yeah, but still some dust. 
almost at the top. Huh. You know, New Austin almost looks kind of beautiful from this angle. Hmm. Maybe. So you don't look at it and think of all the bullshit that's happened to you. Oh my god, actual trees. <laughs> I'll be damned. Hmm. Now, another thing. What about the towns? I don't know what they're going to be like, if there is any. Well, if you plan on sticking with us, then we'll just have to learn about them together. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Wow. Look at all those trees up there. <sighs> it's a lot cooler, too. I could definitely yeah. live up here instead. I'll turn right here. <clears throat> Here, train. There's a ranch over here. Don't worry about that later. Hmm. Yeah, I've never seen this part of the state. Maybe if there's some road signs up ahead, we can see where we're at. At least we know there's people around here. Let's go to Thieves Landing. Yeah, we'll right stop by. <laughs> I don't know if we want to go there. Sounds a bit dangerous. <laughs> Some mountains in the distance too. I can finally stop wearing this damn poncho. Yeah, <laughs> you and me both. Gonna need to get some new outfits, though. Huh. Nice, clean river. Oh, this is much better than the desert, without a doubt. Uh, this definitely ain't the same state anymore now. a little bit. Think anything nearby would be a good spot? Going a bit far. Yeah, this does look like some good land. Hmm. Oh, another river over there. Oh, electric posts. <laughs> At least we know there's electricity. Stone had one of those, but it was all busted. Because they never really attempted at it. One yeah. try, one fail, that's all it took for them to give up. Ah. Oh. Is that snow? I'll be damned. <laughs> we can definitely thrive in this land. Let's keep going. <clears throat> oh, this spot over here, yeah, this will be nice. Let's keep this in mind. You got a thing to write in? Want to keep going, or should we head back? Uh, we could take a little bit more of a look, but you got a journal on you? We'll right down the spot? I always do. Yeah, well, give me a second. I can find it. Yeah. I, <clears throat> I think this would be a nice spot to put camp. around it for now, just the location. I'll write right. down more if I get the chance. Uh, Alright, let's go up ahead a little bit more and see if we can find something. 
maybe a town. Won't go into it, but we can scout it out from a distance. God damn, look at that land in the distance. Oh. Love to live there, but wait, wait, we are wait. going a little bit too far. I think I see buildings in the distance there. Yep. Oh, that looks promising. <laughs> really? What does it look like? An actual town. No. <laughs> Nothing that's just filled with people who look like shit. <laughs> Workers. Travelers, traders, it looks like. Supplies. Oh, that actually is a beautiful sight. <laughs> looks like we can thrive here. Definitely got to pay this place a visit once we're all set up. Well, uh, let's go back and get the rest of the gang then. Yep. <clears throat> all right, y'all. You guys did really well. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, I'm just glad we're finally out of that desert. Yeah, it's much cooler up here. Much more green as well, reminds me of home. <laughs> mm -hmm. Much cooler. Trees. So, where's Clyde and that young gun at? Uh, I probably went to sleep already. Wait, yeah. have they not arrived yet? I don't remember. Oh, uh, wait, no, that's... Okay, I'm talking it. Riding in a wagon for days on end must be a pain in the ass. Yeah, yeah, I can agree to that. Uh, me and Arthur here it's when we arrived. He's about it like, holy shit. A simple ride, fuck me. It's not a horse. <laughs> Anyways, when me and Arthur first got here scouting out the land, we saw a town in the distance, looked like a small city. We didn't go into it, cause, well, figure we wouldn't ruin the surprise. <laughs> Looked pretty lucrative, though. Nice. Anyway, was it breathtaking? In a way. <laughs> to me, it was. It's such a sack compared to Tombstone. <laughs> I'll believe when I see it. I just want to know if there's drink or not. It probably is. I assume so in a place like that. Anyway, uh... Clara, what do we do next? Well, let's go get some sleep. And then in the morning, we can see what's up with this town. <laughs> no problem. Sounds like a plan to me. <clears throat> I'm fine with sleeping in my own bed. <laughs> <laughs>